of ours. Again, this is the most powerful eastern Pacific storm on record, as a matter of fact, since we've been keeping records. And here you can see our very powerful hurricane, the central dense overcast, very well intact here. The center of circulation, the eye, is still in the center of the central dense overcast, so we're continuing to see winds probably remaining at 185. Although we do think that it may have peaked out and over the next couple of days as it tracks off towards the northwest and counting some cooler waters possibly, maybe some westerly winds aloft, that we'll start to see Hurricane Linda coming down a little bit. Now, what's in the forecast for us, right? Southern California right here, Baja, Mexico. Well, the forecast is to keep this on a northwesterly track. Now, as we get in the next 36 hours or so, it gets a little trickier. We do have a trough, a deepening trough here in the west. And with the trough, you get westerly winds. And as this tracks off to the northwest, it's possible it could get picked up with these westerly winds and brought inland. Now, it could happen here. It could happen here. Again, that's pretty far out. Let's talk more about Hurricane Linda. Now, you can see on a satellite, actually, this visible. I thought I took this out. You can barely see it now. But actually, you can see the first couple of shots pretty good here. Actually, this is the island of Socorro. We did have the eye pass very close to Socorro, probably getting the strongest winds over the island. And for red shot, we're looking at a very powerful storm. You know why, how we know that by looking at this? Because this is what we call the central dense overcast. Now, the eye, or the center of the circulation, the warm area of the storm, is right in the center of the central dense overcast. So if it would, the eye would meander this way or this way or come you know, to the other end of the central dense overcast, we might say maybe the intensity is fluctuating. And we think this could happen with this hurricane. We could see fluctuations in the intensity here over the next couple of days. But the heaviest in the plains. And Pretty quiet. <laughs> <laughs> quiet there, not so quiet not here. So quiet here. <laughs> if you're traveling through central sections of the U.S., you could run into some severe weather. We'll tell you where to be careful. A player in the